the traditional start to Royal Week in Scotland at Holyrood Palace. But a very big difference this year. His Majesty the King attends his first ceremony of the keys at his official Scottish residence as monarch. Meanwhile, members of 47 Regiment Royal Artillery fire a 21-gun salute from Edinburgh Castle, marking the King's arrival. It's been a really great experience. It's not every day, you know, that you get to come up and uh, celebrate the arrival of the King on his um, first week in Scotland since uh, since being crowned. So actually, the, you know, it's been a, a brilliant learning experience, but also great to be part of a bit of history and something that we won't ever really get a chance to do again. Incredible experience, really. Like just being a part of the whole thing is just amazing, really. It's a once in a lifetime opportunity for me, especially being in the regiment for only a matter of months. So it's, yeah, something quite special, really. This marks the beginning of a series of royal engagements in Scotland throughout the week. Royal Week is an annual tradition here in Edinburgh, with the monarch always coming to the capital for the summer season. For the last 70 years, it's been Her Majesty the Queen. Now this year, for the first time in his position of monarch, it's King Charles that's taking the lead. He will be presented with Scotland's crown jewels later in the week at a service of thanksgiving and dedication and members of all three branches of the armed forces will be part of the spectacle. I'm really proud to be involved in it. Um, I've had touch points across the, the whole of the length of the Royal Mile from Crown Square uh, into St Giles and uh, down to the palace itself. And um, the, seeing the honours themselves come out on Wednesday uh, for the first time, we've been practising with replicas. Uh, apart from the new sword, which is really, really nice, um, it's going to be uh, pretty good to see. This marks the beginning of the pomp and ceremony of what's seen as the Scottish leg of the coronation, with the military playing a vital part. David Sibbles McCann, Forces News, Edinburgh. Thanks for watching. For more from Forces News, like and subscribe to our channel.